okay I've got a problem with this diesel eater the pump stopped I'll just show you how you test it just unplug the um, connector but first off sometimes if you tap it here it might start so just unplug it and then uh, test it by putting some power directly to the two connectors here but don't cross the wires um, and you'll see if it if it just sparks and doesn't click you know it's it's gone and it's the pump so just get a couple of wires it doesn't matter which way around you try it but just put them on and see if it's uh, see it's just sparking and not clicking that pumps had it so I'm gonna swap it out just get a bit of tissue under there and I'll change the pump out just do uh, Loosen these clamps off. You don't want to drip any diesel into the housing or anything because it'll just smell straight into your house or room, whatever you're heating. Tighten the pipes back up. And I'll just show you that this one's working, hopefully. So you can hear that one working. Plug it back in. And I'll just uh, start the heater. So it's just come on. I think the um, glow plug's warming up. I've got it running on a transformer and I've got a battery to it in case the power goes off. So you can hear it chicken away. So hopefully that will be fixed. Let's see if it lights up first on. Okay, took two starts because uh, it obviously had an airlock in the fuel. Uh, it's racing away now, running a treat. Uh, there you go. Right, it's running in here, lovely now. Fixed it, uh, about 12, 13 pounds for a fuel pump. Off Amazon, I'll put some links in the description. Uh, please subscribe to my videos. Thank you very much. Happy heating.